What's up guys, so today we're going to be installing some coilovers on a Z31, we're going to be doing an S13 conversion uh, on the suspension, and uh, we're going to be doing it on my brother's car, who's right there, I wonder what it is, I don't know, I don't know what it is, <laughs> what is it, where is it, bro, I'm not your box, bro, <laughs> oh, they tricked you, you, <laughs> <laughs> it's just smaller <laughs> all the way down <laughs> to like the like a coilover keychain. <laughs> <laughs> it's a literal it's a literally a smaller box of the big box. Look. <laughs> it's just he's going to keep keep going. smaller and smaller. <laughs> no, I didn't. So Bailey's first coilovers. Oh. Whoa! Check this out, boo. So Bailey decided to go with the mono SS from Godspeed. Because they're pink, yeah. That's the reason why he picked know. it. I yeah. Use cheaper. <laughs> no, they're more expensive for the pink. Yeah. I don't know. No. I don't know the difference. But the red ones are cheaper, but he was like, "Nah, yeah. get the pink with the white." Yeah. Yeah. Only hundred dollars more. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot. Okay, guys. So we are getting the first rear coilover in. Being this over here, tightening down the top hat. This is the old shock. You guys can see. There's three bolts, whereas the top of the new coilover for the S13 only has two. Um, you do have to order an adapter so that way they fit into the mounting point on the Z31. Again, these are S13 coilovers, so to sell this adapter that you stick into the bottom mount just like that bolt it up to the original mounting point um this changes it to a true style coilover with the spring on the actual shock whereas the shock or the spring was in this spring bucket mounting section right here um he did have cut springs the previous owner cut the spring so it was easy to just pull it straight out so if not you're gonna have to have somebody step on the wheel to get the shock out Fit. fit? No? It doesn't fit. Oh. Damn, we need to widen that thing. Push this down here. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's so late, right? No, but that's good. You see? You see the mountain? Yeah. Not because the uh, the down. So guys, thing. guys. So. <laughs> okay. okay. I'll grab the other blue thing too after. Huh? Oh, yeah. What's up, you guys? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah. 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 I saw that. I told you it's my finger, bro. Oh, I, 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 I told you to watch out for it. Oh, it's a perfect height. Yeah, for now. Okay, that's so sore. Yeah. <laughs> that's so sore. <laughs> You're going to learn like three four more times. <laughs> okay, guys. So we're going to do the front right now. Tell them what we're going to do. We're gonna do the front right now. <laughs> okay, so we take off the tie rod and then we're gonna undo this whole shock slash hub thing with these two under here. Yeah, the whole spindle gonna come off. And then we're gonna undo the tension rod. We just have to defend. Dirty Bailey. I'll pull them out. Yeah, there you go. 
Okay. Hey. Now we just gotta cut that. Yeah, cherry. Outside shell, so you you go around. You know what I mean? Like you're not gonna go straight through it. Why? Cause it's just a shell. There's a shock in the inside of that. Okay guys, so I just welded it up. It's not pretty. I think my welds are getting a little better, but it still looks kind of like doo doo welds. But yeah, so this is all welded up. We're gonna go ahead and throw this in the car now. All right guys, so I have this spindle all set up and ready to go back in the car, but just to show you guys, it's just an adapter like this that will allow us to uh, adapt the lower mount to this. Um, and then we also have this corrector for the ball joint down here. We push it out just a little bit so that way it'll affect for the angle of the adapter. And yeah, we have the coil over right here and we just gotta put it in. Right on top of there. Okay guys, we got the whole car put together. We're gonna go ahead and drop it down. See if it's at a good height for Bailey. Ooh, bro, this thing is slammed, bro. Wow, that's a lot lower than I thought it was gonna turn out. Oh, we have to raise it. Yeah, at least a little bit so you can turn. Yeah. At least to match the rear, cause yeah, the rear is gonna be like It's yeah. gonna be slammed when you put your lip on. Yeah. Oh, you wanted to see it. You wanna put the lip on the front? Yeah, I'll just put it against it right yeah. now. Yeah. Put it up against it. Oh yeah. It does look better now that it's not flared like the, the fenders on bus. It looks way better than the stock, bruh. I hate that. If <laughs> you're bumping. Oh, it looks sick. It looks sick. You might be able to. Bailey, where did your car go? It's right here, silly girl. <laughs> 